guys, today I'm going to talk to you about large animal safety, specifically horse safety. Everybody loves to be around their horse, but are they truly being safe? The most important rule is that a horse needs to learn to respect your space. It is a 1,000 pound animal and you could easily get hurt by it. If they're in your space, ask them to move as I am doing here. Now the safest way to hold your lead rope is not by wrapping it around your hand. If the horse kicks off, it's going to take you with him if you have it wrapped around your hand. So fold it accordion style and lead like that. The safest way to turn your horse is to turn away from you. That way if the horse spooks, they will spook away from you. The safest place to pet a horse, like the example on my poster, is the shoulder or the neck area. This way they can see you. You never want to stand behind a horse. If you need to go around them, stand back at least 10 to 15 feet and walk around them that way. Spots on a horse is right in front of their face, on their nose, and back behind their butt. The safest way to groom your horse is to stand at the side and groom. When you pick up their hooves, be sure to stand at the side Hoof, please. and pick up their hooves that way. I see a lot of people stand behind their horse while they brush their tail. If you're going to groom the tail, stand at the side and brush it this way. Places that you don't want to stand are back here because, you know, they might kick you. <laughs> Something that I see a lot of people do is moving underneath of a horse's neck. Never go under a horse. Never kneel down next to a horse. If they ever spook or get scared, they'll spook right into you and you'll fall over and most likely get trampled. So always stand when you're next to a horse. Something you should always wear while riding is a helmet. No matter how small or how big, helmets are a big part of large animal safety. 65 to 80% of all horse accident injuries are head injuries, so it's always safe to use your helmet. Also make sure that you use the proper equine helmets. Do not use motorcycle or bicycle helmets for riding because they are not specifically certified for riding. I also wanted to talk about safety while mounting a horse. A horse should never, ever, ever move while you mount them because your foot could get caught partially in the stirrup and you could get drugged. For your safety, you should always correct this behavior. This is an example of how your horse should stand while mounting. The safest way to tie your horse for both you and your horse's safety is to tie a safety knot in case of trouble. How to tie a safety knot is you, you put the rope over your board, make a circle and put it over, bring the rope back underneath and through the hole and tighten. This way if you and your horse get in trouble, you can pull the knot and it will come loose. For yours and your horse's safety, never walk or ride over ice. Letting a horse go out to the pasture, always face them towards you or towards a gate so they don't buck or spook into you. No matter how big or how small, safety is always important.